three minute Friday. Maximum information in the shortest amount of time. Let's get started. Does Katra affect a bear shaft shooting? Uh, this arrow is a 300 spine, quite stiff, no fletching. I shoot 10 meters without Katra. Let's see what the shaft is saying. So you see the arrow sticks with the knock a little to the right. We do it again. So again, arrow sticks a little to the right. And now we do a little Hatra. Arrow still sticks to the right. Let's do it again. Still arrow sticks to the right. Now, would Hatra and string twist change something? Let's find out. Still to the right. One more time before so much fun. Katra string twist. Whatever I do, the arrow sticks a little to the right. Only one hope, which is torque. Still maybe not that much, but still it's all the same, at least for me. One more time torque. same angle all the time. I think personally it has more to do with your release when you discuss these all these katra things first get your release right when the release is bad all the katra magic doesn't do anything. Let's try again normal down katra maybe only down katra. See no matter the arrow is always in the same angle to the right and one more time no katra. Same angle. What we didn't try is no cut but string twist. Still the same. And we didn't try torque at string twist. Oh, it looks it went a little more straight. Torque string twist. Nah, it's still the same. No matter what I shoot, no khatra, side down khatra, torque, string twist, the arrow ends up always roughly in the same degree. The knock is off to the right at the distance of nine, eight, nine meters or something. That's me. And that's all I have for you today. Thank you very much for watching. Catch you in the next one.